Hello guys, welcome to part 3 of car designing. So in previous tutorials, we have already designed this. If you haven't watched that video, you can watch that link is given in description. So let's start and move further. We will go to imagine and shape. Okay, let it be. We will double click it there. Okay. Now, what I will do is make this object little bit transparent. So for that, select this, click uh, right click on that and uh, go to properties. Now go to graphics and make transparency up to 100. That's it. Now you can go to front view. And you can see this is not aligned properly so for that what we need to do is select here face cutting now select a horizontal edge on this surface select the horizontal edge anyone that's it click here on ok now go to move tool this is the move tool and we need to deselect this edges so for that press control and just select these two edges now align these two edges according to your sketch that's it it's okay now we will go to side view okay that's okay and the top view to verify that okay Wait a minute, there is one problem here. These images are again not properly aligned. So go to top view. Double click on that. And sorry for that. Double click on this. Just move it. Zoom that. Move this white line up to this edge. And zoom this. This white line up to the ending edge. Okay. That's it. Okay, so what we will do now is extrude this line. So for that, select our extrude command. And this is extrusion. Now select this surface and select each edge. You can press control and select all of them. Okay. That's it. And you can press this. Now go to side view. Sorry for that. This one. And it's okay. Now you can adjust that. Just select this and move that little bit upwards this little bit downwards and this also little bit downwards okay move this here we will keep it straight and select this and move this on uh, mesh also move this on mesh that it be this one and it's okay now what we'll do we will go to front view okay you can see this is not properly aligned so we will do that now what we need to do is here we will make a sketch go to front view and select here this one extrude now you need to draw a sketch on this reference line okay let's escape and then yes and go to side view now extrude this sorry move that let's shift and select this and move that along x-axis okay. 
that's it now let's escape now select this uh, double click on this sketch and select here this command affinity sorry alignment i'm sorry align right now you need to select the plane which we have made now uh, this is the plane subdivision surface 2 now what we will do is select this point and just click on this icon same for all points go to i think so go to front view sorry side view So what it will do is bring all that point and this mesh along the mesh. Go to front view. Okay, so you can see all that points have been aligned along the mesh. So that's what it do. Now go to again what we say left view. So this is uh, properly aligned. That's it. Press escape. Now you can delete this or hide that. I will hide this and you can see this will be an aligned. Now we will subdivide this again. So select this face subdivision and select any of the horizontal edge and press here. Okay. Now go to move tool and go to front view. So move that little bit upwards like this that's it go to top view okay that's okay and go to side view okay it's okay. I think so. It's okay. So I'm uh, select all these edges and give them affinity. So select this edge. I'm pressing control and press here on affinity and just give them affinity of nearly ninety to hundred percent so that it will make it sharper like this the edge will become sharp on the corner now what we will do is go to uh, this surface and select this plane now again you need to select uh, what we say this uh, alignment and again select this subdivision surface tool and now align this to the surface select this plane align that to the surface select this plane align that to the surface sorry for that okay select this plane and align that Also select this plane, bottom one, and align that to the surface. That's it. Now, again select the line tool and select all these lines. Before that, select here affinity or attraction, what do you say? And make it nearly 80 to 90 percent. That's it. You can see here the shape has been formed. So double click on this and go to side view. Now this is little bit away from this, uh, this line. So what I will do is move this along the mesh. 
and this also along the mesh. That's it. This also a little bit inwards along the mesh and this also a little bit inwards along the mesh. Okay. That's it. Now, copy and face cutting again and select this and just move that. Sorry for that. Select this uh, move command here, cut manipulation and move that upwards. Okay. Again, select here and move that little bit downwards. Click here on OK. So you can see what this makes. It is a edge become sharper. This edge become sharper. So this process we will do at ending. Okay. So moving further. Now what we will do is align this on a plane. You can see inside view that this is little bit downward. This is little bit upward and here it is a curvy surface. Sorry, curvy edge. So we will align it on a plane. So for that, what you need to do is select here. Sorry for that. Select here this command. What do you say that alignment? And you need to select this align on plane. Okay, this is align on plane. You need to select this and we need to select the plane here on which we need to align. So I am not getting that plane. Yes, this plane. So it should be aligned on that plane and you can double press escape. Now go to side view again and you can see this is a straight line now. Okay, you can see this in front view also. This is a straight line. So it has been properly aligned. Now we will move further. Let's go to left view. That is side view. Yeah, I made a mistake in pre uh, I made a mistake before that I extruded this part up to here. So I edited that and uh, moved it little bit upward. Okay. So let's move this on X axis little bit here. That's it. Now we will extrude this. So select here extrusion command, select all this edits. This one and this one also. Now go to front view or side view and click here on OK and move that. Okay, you can scale that also. So for scaling, select here affinity and scale that along x axis little bit. Now move that. Okay, that's it. You can just move this uh, on each like that and little bit inwards for the uh, curvy surface. This also little bit inwards. That's it. Now again, select extrusion command and extrude till here. So select this. Sorry for that. I selected wrong command. So select this extrusion command. Select this surface and select all these edges by pressing Ctrl. And click here on OK and then extrude that. Extrude that along Z axis. Move that little bit on X axis and you can move this inward. And by pressing shift, selecting all this, you can move this little bit here. Also for this, that's it. Okay, that is this as in the Okay, so we will design the front one. The front uh, what we see bumper or what i don't know so we will design it in next part so till then thank you